Hello, hello, hello. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. My beautiful, beautiful Virgos, by the time you, you see this video, I hope everyone is staying safe. I love you guys. How are y'all doing on this beautiful Monday? How are y'all feeling? I absolutely love you guys. How are you doing today? I hope you all had a beautiful weekend. How was your weekend? <laughs> good, good. That's good. Let's get into the energy, okay? Let's get into the energy and see what the Spirit God's God got for you, my beautiful Virgos. Hello to all of my new viewers. Cross watchers. Hello. Yeah, I'm positive thoughts and energy. Very strong intuitive reader. I am an energy healer. Okay, let's get started. Let's see what's in the bottom of the deck, Virgo. It's clarity. Come on in, everyone. Take what resonates. Reverse the roles, everybody. How they fit in your life. I don't know your life. So you're going to have to reverse the roles. How they fit in your life, baby. So a lot of you are about to gain some clarity about something. Something is about to come to light. There's some truth coming out. And this card says, as I began walking my path of self-discovery, I find clarity with each step taken in new truths of discovery. So a lot of you are on a new path and you gain so much clarity about this new journey, about this new path that you're on. Doesn't it feel good? Doesn't it feel different? I know it feels strange, but baby, it's a beautiful thing, Virgo. Okay, for a lot of you that are just waking up, hello, hello, how are you? Welcome, welcome. A lot of you are waking up to your higher self. You raise, you have raised, risen your, raised your vibration, your energy level, your frequency, and you're gaining a lot of clarity. You're seeing things differently. You're seeing people in situations for what they truly, truly are. So congratulations, hello. I'm glad you woke. Welcome, welcome to the spiritual realm. Welcome to your your spiritual sisters and brothers, okay? Your uncles and uncles and aunts and whatever you want to call it, okay? So definitely you gain this some clarity, okay? Um, behind that is synchronicity. So a lot of you may have started seeing a lot of signs and synchronicities, okay? Uh, when you start to see synchronicities, you gain a clarity. A lot of you are realizing how manifestation works. And so you gain a clarity, not only clarity, seeing things for what they truly are, but you're seeing synchronicities and numbers. That means that whatever you have been trying to create into your life, Virgo, it is about to come to fruition. And this card says, I invite synchronicities into my life each day, giving proof to the manifestations of my heart's desire. So whatever your heart's desire, whatever it is that, you about, that you've been uh, manifesting, you're about to get some clarity. I feel like Spirit Guys God is saying, you are about to to see your manifestation come to light. Spirit guys, tell me more. Give me one more. Give me one more inspiration. Thank you. Your confidence. The power that you have. The confidence. The aura that you the, the power that you put into your manifestation. Your aura, your vibration, okay? Uh you your confidence, your strength, okay? Your endurance, okay? Uh that is what is aligning you to your abundance. And it says, I have confidence in all that I do in all areas of my life. So the way you walk, the way you talk, the confidence, even though people don't realize that you're going through day by day a lot of pain, that you're enduring a lot, that you got a lot on your mind, that a lot is weighing on you very heavy, and they don't realize that it takes a lot of strength to walk in confidence and still act as if nothing is wrong and still keep having faith and still believing that God or whoever your higher source is going to see you through and that things are going to come to you because God promised it. When you ask it, He's going to do it for you. So a lot of you gain a lot of clarity. That part right there. Let's see what else is here. You realize that you are, look here. You realize that you are worthy. It says aim for what you want, Virgo, and believe in yourself. Aim for what you want. Aim, baby, and believe in yourself. Believe in yourself. Be confident in who you are. Be confident in that very thing that you're trying to manifest. Speak it. Speak it. Speak it. The way is clear, Spirit Guides are saying. The way is clear for you. Speak it into existence. Speak it. Write it down. Write it down. Speak it. Say it over and over. Call it into your space. Call it into your energy. Call it. Call it. Call it. 
the way is clear. Spirit guides God say the road is clear. Okay, and it says, awaken to the power within you. It's all about in you. It's all about your confidence. It's all about the aura that you bring. Oh, baby, it's all about the aura that you bring. Give me one more card, Spirit Guides for Virgo. One more card. I love you guys. Spirit Guides is saying, stay the course. Whatever you do, stay the course. Let, let me show you. It's so many messages in here for you, Virgo. Spirit Guides, I'm going to get it all to you. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Stay with me. Don't fast forward. Stay with me, y'all, okay? There are messages. There are blessings, lessons, and confirmations in all of my readings, okay? So stay with me. So the first one is Spirit Guides is saying, stay the course, Virgo, okay? It says, you are moving in the right direction. <laughs> the next card is saying, you are a bright energy. And it says, color uplifts you. So a lot of you may love color. You may love, that color is your colorful things is your is what helps keep you vibrating at a higher frequency color color okay you are worthy the way is clear the road is clear uh go ahead and manifest your heart's desire have confidence in it put a lot of energy in it put a lot of power in it speak it speak it as though it already is i don't know who needs to hear this but spirit guys is giving me to tell you and give you confirmation is that the very thing that you're trying to manifest spirit guys say i need you to walk it i need you to talk it i need you to sleep it i need you to i need you to put it in your spirit the bottom of this deck is um it says be clear on what you want be clear of what you want virgo and it says Put actions into your goals. Make them a reality, sweetheart, sir. Come on, let's do it. Let's do it because miracles happen every single day. Don't play with God, the universe. Don't play because uh, it ain't nothing too small, too big for God. Okay, miracles happen every day, sweetheart. It says, give the universe your clear intentions. Spirit guides want you to be clear. Okay, I, I, I'm just saying, it's double confirmation here. Whatever you do, listen to me. If you listen to nothing else I'm saying in this reading, Virgo, whatever you do, whatever you do, be clear on your manifestation. Be clear. Be clear about it. Ma miracles happen every day. Stay confident, walk in it, speak it, write it down. When you write it down, that means you're writing it into existence. You're creating it into your life. I'm trying to teach a lot of you that may not know how to manifest. Manifestation is all in the power of the tongue. Your manifestation is all in the power of your tongue. Your tongue holds power. Your thoughts hold power. You create it. You bring it into existence. And so how you know that your blessings is on its way, that the very thing that you're manifesting that is on the way, my beautiful, beautiful Virgos, is that you're going to see the proof is the synchronicities in your life. Okay, the proof is in the pudding. You start to see your, your heart's desire, things start to come. Now, how God operates, or whoever your higher source, I don't know who your higher source is. So, take what resonates, everybody, reverse the roles, how they fit in your life. But how it works is that God begins, how you know your manifestations is getting closer. The big one, the big one, he got to first start to sprinkle the small blessings so that you can get the hint that the big blessings are coming. I don't know who who needs to hear this right now. And I know that's what we all, if you always hear people say that's cliche. I don't know who needs to hear this, but I really don't know who needs to hear this. But Spirit Guys, God say, I'm going to let you know right now in this reading, how you know that your manifestation, that your hard desire is getting closer. It's because I'm getting ready to sprinkle some other blessings. I'm getting ready to sprinkle some small blessings around your feet, around your body, around your mind, around your soul. I'm getting ready to sprinkle some some. some some, some hints. I'm about to give you some hints that is getting closer. I'm about to give you some clarity that is getting closer. That your manifestation, your blessings are getting closer. You just got to know that you're worthy of it. You have to know that you're worthy of it. When you realize that you're worthy of it and you have the confidence in what it is, the confidence, your worth, 
worthy confidence in what it is that you're trying to create, what it is that you want to come to fulfillment in your life, then that's when you start to see the results. That's when you start to see the universe, God, whoever your higher source start to work in your favor. But you must not contradict yourself. You must not say one thing and do another because you kill the spirit of your manifestation. Because whatever this is that you manifesting that you think it, that you think could never happen, it happens every day. Miracles happen every day, every single day. So let me tell you something. Spirit God say, awaken to the power within you. It's in you. Spirit God said, the way is clear. You just go ahead and you say exactly what you want. Stay the course. Don't get off. Do not veer off. Do not stay on this path. Do not veer off, Virgo. Even though this path of some of you been going through it and it's been feeling bumpy and you've been going through it, it's like, it's like it's, you've been stressed out maybe over bills, over relationships, over situationships, and it just seemed like you're on the wrong path. Spirit God said, you're not on the wrong path. You are not on the wrong path. It's just that some of you was following another path of someone else. You understand? And it says, following the path of another. Your path is being redirected to where it should be. Some of you was going towards somebody. Some of, some of you were going towards someone else's path. You were on the wrong path. And Spirit God said to get you back on your path. You was getting ready to go on someone else's path that was gonna that you were going to be devastated by. So you had to be redirected. Some of you about to fall off the cliff. Some of you is about to literally fall off the cliff with somebody. Whether this was a relationship that you thought that was going in the direction that you want, you was headed to go. You was headed to go right off that cliff. I know, right? I know you looking like wow. Yeah. If you wonder why it went black blacked out, the relationship or somebody you was talking to, or someone that you was really liking, and it went black, it blacked out, and it and, and it and it and it just went away. That's because spirit guys had to do, had to move you out of that because you was getting ready to go off a cliff. Yeah, your life was gonna change drastically. It was gonna change for the worse because you was on the wrong path. So spirit guides, God had to redirect you. And that's why at the bottom of this deck, and that's why this card is here, and it's saying stay the course. Listen to me, listen to me clearly. Do not fast forward the videos. A lot of you miss a lot of it, a lot of uh, uh, confirmations because everybody wants to hurry up and get to the point. Stay the course. Now that God, whoever your higher source have got you back on the path of getting ready to end your life, getting ready to go down a path with somebody that was had you headed in destruction, in destruction, now Spirit God said, now I need you to focus on you, focus on your confidence, focus on creating your own life. Stop living your life through someone else. Stop trying to be on the path with someone else and help them live their life. You got to live your life. What you're asking for God to do for you, what you're asking for God, whatever it is, or whoever your higher source you ask it, your heart's desire, whatever you're trying to manifest, I really feel like you're saying it's going to take a miracle because the situation that I'm in, Miss Foster Thoughts and Energy, I don't think God can help me out. I don't think the universe or whoever your higher source can help me because I'm in too deep. Let me tell you something. Let me, let me, let me go ahead and tell you something. Ain't nothing too big, too small, too nothing for God. You understand? Let me tell you, somebody's worse off than you, baby. You think you got it bad? <laughs> mm, mm -mm. It's always somebody worse off than we are. 14, 14. So let's see what's going on here. Stay the course. Because your manifestation is coming. Your manifestation is coming. Your manifestation is coming. Your manifestation is coming. Say it. My manifestation is coming. My manifestation is coming. My manifestation is coming. Say it. Say it. Speak it. Speak it. My manifestation is coming. It's coming. You got messages. You got a message coming. You're going to hear your manifestation is getting ready to arrive. It's arriving. It's arriving. Look at here. Ten of wands in the reverse. Baby, you've been stressed out. But baby, let me tell you something. You're no longer going to be stressed out. 
Oh yeah, that ten of wands is turned upside down. No more stressing. You've been stressing. You've been stressing over bills. You've been stressing over something. You've been stressing. But let me tell you something. The message that is about to come towards you within the next eight days, I'm not even going to say four or two weeks. It's going to make you so happy. Yeah, you've been worried. You've been worried. Look at that. You've been all in your head worried. Hadn't been able to sleep. Virgo, there go your card. This, this is absolutely your message. But Spirit God is God that said, baby, let me tell you something. I got you. Hi. <laughs> got you. Spirit God's God said, I got you. I got it coming for you, baby. I got it coming. You've been searching. You've been waiting. You've been searching. I got it coming for you, honey. Just keep being that beautiful soul to have that beautiful heart. Keep falling. Keep doing what you're doing, baby. I got you. God said, stay the course. God said, stay the course. Abundance, 1111. Happiness, you get ready. You conquer. You get ready to conquer a lot. <laughs> The moon in the reverse. You're about to learn the truth. You're about to learn the truth. I'm here to tell you about to learn the truth. I, I, I can't make this up. Spirit God said, I don't know who you are, but some of you get ready. Spirit God's getting ready, getting ready to create a miracle in your life. There is a miracle that is about to be created in your life. And the reason why God is getting ready to bless you in this way, whoever your higher source is getting ready to bless you in this way, Virgo, is because God wants you to know that it came from the source. Wants you to know that it came from the higher source, the higher source, God himself, the realm, the angelic realm. You understand? This, 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 this blessing that's coming, this, this manifestation that you prayed about, it's going to hit different. It's going to hit different because you're going to know. It, 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 it took a miracle. You're going to know that nobody on earth in this 3D realm that we're living in had nothing to do with this blessing that is about to happen in your life. Yeah. Something good is about to happen in your life something good there's a miracle that is about to take place in your life you're not going to see it coming and this is coming from the universe you're not going to see it coming this is the spirit bringing you this cup yeah you've been disappointed let down everything but you're not going to see this coming baby you're not going to see this coming you prayed about it your prayers your prayers being answered some of you been out of work some of you hadn't been able to work good. You've been praying, okay? You've been out of work. You've been on your back out of work. You've been sick. You hadn't been getting the hours in that you wanted. You know, you've been behind, it's starting to fall back behind, behind on your bills. But something good. <laughs> there is a message that is about to pop up in your life. There is a message. There is uh, uh, some money that is coming towards you. I can't make this up. Someone is going to help you. You understand? There's going to be someone that's going to help you. That spirit guy's God is going to sit. That spirit guy's God is going to send your way. Okay? I see stability for you. I see money. I see prosperity. My God, do you hear me? What? Oh, my goodness. Things are changing. Look at... I can't make this up. Do you see what I see? Ten of Pentacles. King of Pentacles. Look at that. Look at that. Ace of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, and the Wheel of Fortune. Stay the course. You're on your destiny. You are right where you're supposed to be, baby. Let me tell you something. Ten toes down, standing back on business. Let me tell you, when I tell you God can, can create a miracle in your life, God can create a miracle in your life, baby. Because you released. You released a lot of toxic devil energy. Some of you may have been with somebody recently or talked to someone or, or whatever the situation. You released something and you started calling in your power. When I told you earlier, when you if you if you uh, rewind this video, call it in. My manifestation is what? My manifestation is coming. My manifestation is coming. My manifestation is coming. My blessing is coming. You got to speak it. You got to be confident in it. And you get ready to gain clarity because God said, I got a miracle. This blessing is coming towards you. 
I want you, I, the Spirit of God's God wants you to know that it is a miracle from God. I want you to know that this Ten of Pentacles, I don't know who you are. Some of you coming into some big money. God is about to bless you. You are about to be blessed beyond your measures. I don't know who you are. But the wheel is turning in your favor. Spirit of God's God say, just stay on your path because you, you, you are about to be fruitful. You're about to be fruitful. You're about to be fruitful, Virgo. You showed up in your own reading, baby. You've been worried. You've been crying. You've been up late at night. You've been praying. You've been asking God to help you. Help me, God. Help me, higher source. Help me praying on your back. Ain't been working good. Been out of work. Been missing days. Check has been terrible. The Spirit of God said, I got a miracle that's about to form in your life. Something good. <laughs> something good, something good is about to take place in your life. Something good. I am your blessings. There are blessings, excuse me. There are blessings, confirmations, and lessons in all of my readings. You just got to be vigilant and listen to the message. I love you guys, but your life is about to change. Some of you, everybody on different timelines, but the will is turning in your favor. And when I tell you, miracles happen every day. Miracles happen every day. And God said, this is going to be a night. This is going to be a miracle to remember. Yeah, that's what Spirit God's God just said. Virgo, this is going to be a miracle to remember. Until next time, my beautiful souls.